Hey guys, Belle here from Disney and 3 here to talk to you about Animal Kingdom's four best rides. Um, Animal Kingdom is one of my favorite parks because there's just so much wildlife and uh, foliage. I don't even know how they made it look such like a like a rainforest in only a few years. I mean, it's only about, I guess it's about 12 years old. Um, but once you, you gotta see it to believe it. And um, so let me just share these four best rides for you, especially if it's your first time going to Disney World and um, you want something to please the entire family, these are gonna be awesome. So number one, my absolute favorite ride at Disney's Animal Kingdom is Dinosaur, especially with the, the new Jurassic Park movie that just came out. It's definitely gonna be probably pretty crowded, um, but it's awesome. Like you board this Jeep, uh, kind of like in Jurassic Park, and <laughs> uh, you are transported back in time through a, a time machine and um, it's just, it's cool for everybody. Uh, it's actually a little bit scary if you have a child who's afraid of dinosaurs or doesn't like uh, the dark or loud noises, they probably wouldn't enjoy this ride. I definitely wouldn't have enjoyed it at like eight years old, but at 21, <laughs> uh, it's, it's awesome. It's so immersive and the dinosaurs do this look so real. You have like meteor showers going and I don't wanna ruin it, but it's really cool. Definitely check it out with your family. Pretty much everybody is sure to enjoy it, especially if they like the movie. Okay, so my second favorite uh, ride is Kilimanjaro Safaris. Uh, this is a really unique attraction. It's uh, the only one that features, uh, like, instead of audio animatronics, uh, real animals. And the, what's it called? The I guess the enclosure is bigger than the size of the entire Magic Kingdom. So it's huge. They have, like, over a hundred species of animals uh, roaming throughout this park and once again you're in a jeep and you have a like a tour guide with you explaining what animals you'll see and it's really cool if you get to see like uh, some of the big cats like we saw lions last time or maybe you'll glimpse a cheetah I actually heard it's best to go really early in the morning or around sunset that's when you get the most animals because um, they're more active it's not so hot um, they also hang out around the watering holes so be sure to look for you know just animals grazing especially like um you'll get a lot of like hippos or alligators or all sorts of birds they have like a lot of different gazelles it's really cool anybody would like this ride uh it's not really scary um but uh i guess to me the coolest part is every ride is different so it's not like oh i've been on that ride before like i don't want to do it again it's gonna be boring uh because you'll always see different animals so and little kids are sure to love it too um, just be sure to, to hold on to them. You don't want them to fall out. Okay, so the third best ride, Expedition Everest. It's so cool. One of the best roller coasters, too. Uh, people complain that Disney doesn't have that many, like, extreme rides, uh, but this one's pretty good. Uh, it takes you forwards and backwards and goes upwards of 60 miles an hour, um, so it's good for teens, adults, maybe not super small children. I think the height requirement is 42 inches, um, so be sure to measure your kids before you go or before you promise them they can ride this ride. But it's really cool. So you're basically you're going, um, it's told, it's the legend of the Yeti. And you're going up uh, Mount Everest, obviously, Expedition Everest, and uh, it, on your quest to find him or find proof of his existence. So it's really cool. Once again, I don't want to ruin it, but um, a good ride for thrill seekers, maybe uh, a little bit older kids who miss out on the big rides that you would find at other theme parks. Um, so Disney really does have something for everybody. Now my fourth favorite one is not a ride, sorry, <laughs> but it's a show and I'm only talking about this because I was surprised that I liked it. Um, it's called Flights of Wonder. It's actually a show about birds. So the first few times I went to Disney I was like, this is gonna be so boring, like I'm just gonna skip this. I'm gonna go buy, ride Expedition Everest, which is right next door. But um, last time I went my friend made me uh, watch it and it was really cool. Um, they have all sorts of birds. They have a a bald eagle. I didn't know, but they're like enormous. I thought they were the size of like a hawk, like, I don't know, a foot and a half tall, but they're really big. And they have all sorts of birds flying all around. They taught them all these cool tricks. Like, it sounds kind of lame, but I think you should give it a shot. Like, it, it was pretty cool. I was impressed. Um, I thought <laughs> definitely my parents would love it, my sister, um, my fiance. It's a really cool show um, and mostly talking about it because it surprised me how good it was so when you're at Disney try some new things try things that you don't think maybe would appeal to you and you might be pleasantly surprised so I hope you enjoyed this video um, if you have any of you know rides I forgot to mention or ones that you think are the absolute best be sure to comment them below 
Um, if you want to see more videos about how to enhance your Disney vacation or maybe your friends are going on vacation, uh, be sure to share this video or subscribe to my channel. So I hope you guys have a, an amazing trip. This is Belle from Disney in 3 and I'll see you guys next time.